What is going on? Pam, hey, I have another little project for you. Does it have to do with these shopping bags filled with hot dogs? Schmidt! Ah! There is a raccoon in the car, no, there's Dwight! Not. Good morning, everybody. Who would like an authentic New York bagel? Hmm? Identity theft is not a joke, Jim. Michael, you have no idea how high I can fly. Michael, right, you're up. All right, here we go. Right. This is gonna be fun. Ready? Go. All right. First name is Tom. No, no, no. No names. No names. No rhyming. Right, right, no right. sound alike. Right, okay, okay. okay. You're getting it in my head. First name is Blank. And he goes on a cruise. He goes on a Caribbean cruise. I don't know. Katie Holmes. No. Ah! But he's married to her. Oh, Dawson's Creek. No. No, it has to be a real person, Jim. Come on. Okay. Uh, no, no. I'm going to pass. I'm going to pass. Uh, okay. Um, rhymes with... Arnold Schwarzenegger. No rhyming. Well, not That's really not... a rhyme. Okay. Another clue. Another clue. Okay. He is the governor of California. He is the Terminator. Those aren't helpful. Tom Cruise. I hope the war goes on forever and Ryan gets drafted. Wait. I come from a long line of fighters. My maternal grandfather was the toughest guy I ever knew. World War II veteran. Killed 20 men, then spent the rest of the war in an allied prison camp. My father battled blood pressure, and obesity all his life. Different kind of fight. Hello, hello. Top of the morning to ya. <laughs> you pathetic, short little man. You don't have any friends, or any family, or any land. Does anyone smell anything smoky? Did you bring your jerky in again? <clears throat> What's the procedure? I talk a lot, so I've learned to just tune myself out. So, I'm happy to be here. It's very nice to see all of you. You're all looking well. Today's a women in the workplace thing. Jan's coming in from corporate to talk to all the women about, um, I don't really know what, but Michael's not allowed in. She said that about five times. Women today, though we have the same options as men, we often face a very different set of obstacles in getting there. Oh, all right. Hi, any messages? You're soaking wet. Oh, well, Jim and I got caught in a little flash rain, flash winds, flash lightning. Wow, sounds scary. It was, it was. And then in an instant, it wasn't. Why isn't Jim wet? I outran it. Here we go. Make a U-turn, if possible. Are you OK? Swim for it! I am Michael Scott. I am the captain of this party. I'm Captain Jack. I'm captain of the ship. Ah! I'm also captain of anyone who sets foot on the ship. Hi, welcome aboard. Okay. In an office, when you are ranking people, manager is higher than captain. On a boat, who knows? It's nebulos. Watching people get sick always makes me sick. And frankly, so does talking about it. So, wow. In five minutes, this ship is going to be at the bottom of the lake. And there aren't enough spaces on the lifeboat. Who are we going to save? Do we save sales? Do we save customer service? Do we save accounting? This is a business scenario, right? It's a scary, it's a predicament. And it's something that each and every one of us have to think about. Aye, aye, Captain. It's like a home movie. Yeah if Michael Scott did your home movie. This is 11 years, okay? This has been my dream for 11 years. And if you don't think it's great, then you're basically saying you don't believe in my dream. It, it's your dream, you never even mentioned it before. Uh, we talk about a lot of things, Holly. 
you know, I was eventually going to get around to my dream, obviously. 11 years that I could have been working on the Scar Nebulous. Well, why do you have to make a movie at all? Because if I don't have this, what do I have? I have nothing. Really? You can't think of anything else that you might have? Um, this is a white. Well, if we're complaining, a lot of people think your Elvis voice is annoying. Okay, who said that? I'm just people. For the record, I think it's pretty fantastic. Well, thank you. Thank you a lot. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. I am Michael Scott. Hello. Oh, hey, just so you know, if you have any sensitive emails, they need to be deleted immediately. I know. <laughs>